Sagittarius, welcome back to my channel. So let's jump into your messages and see what the universe wants you to know. Your card is flipping out the deck. Already the star card in reverse. Some of you may be dealing with an Aquarius. You don't have faith in this situation anymore. Spirit messages to you. Oh my God, your cards are flying out of the deck. Give me one second. Okay, the chariot reverse. We have Cancer energy. We have Aquarius energy. You lack faith in the situation and you have no clue where it's headed. Some of you are like, I don't know what to do with this anymore. Yep, two of pentacles. I don't know what to do with this relationship anymore. I'm sick of it. <laughs> I'm tired of it. I'm tired of it being up and down. One minute we're getting along, the next minute we're not. What messages do you have for Sagittarius? The will. There's changes. These changes are imminent. Did I say that right? I hope I did. Okay, anyway. Um, there are some changes that are going to happen. They're meant to happen. With the will approaching here. Some of you may be dealing with a fixed sign. A Leo, an Aquarius, a Taurus, or a Scorpio. You're going to be able to bounce back from whatever this is, Sagittarius. I don't feel like you're worried, though. I don't. I just feel like what's pissing you off, um, most Sagittariuses like to control what happens in their life. They like to have it under control, and that's how they 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 work best when they know what they when they know what to expect so they can deal with it and move forward they don't like for things to hold them back and not knowing will piss the Sagittarius off and cause them to like walk away and abandon everything <laughs> okay I have a couple of Sagittarius friends and when they don't feel comfortable with something and they don't know what's going on they're like mm -mm, okay I'm out and so I feel like because of this two of pentacles, you may be like, okay, if I can't figure out what's going on here and this person don't want to act right, then I'm out. I don't know. I'm feeling like you may be out. You're tired of trying to guess. Yep. Look at that. Eight of cups right here. I told you Sagittarius plays no games. <laughs> it's like, keep playing with me. Keep having me confused about what we have going on. And I'm walking away from this. So some of you may be walking away from the situation. If all your cards don't stop jumping out of the deck, Sagittarius, it's either you're going to let somebody know about something or somebody want to let you know about how they feel. But anyway, that was the Justice card reverse. And whenever the Justice card comes out reverse, some of you may be dealing with a Libra or you feel like there's a lot of unfair shit going on here and you don't want to deal with it anymore. You feel like somebody is not being fair. They got too much going on here. They're doing too much behind the scenes. Yep, the tower. Something's falling apart, but somebody's going to try to bring it back together. I don't know if you're having it, though, because we have the magician reversed here with the alchemist and the hierophant and the four of wands. So the problem here, let me just grab this tower. There's so many major arcanas here. We have the Tower, the Magician, the Hierophant, the Justice, the Will. What else do we have here? The Star, the Chariot. All right. I feel like the universe is stepping into this situation. See, if you're asking for change, the universe is going to bring it to you, Sagittarius. They may not bring it to you how you want. It may not be happening the way you would like for it to unfold, but the change is coming because the will is here, okay? So do you want to hang in there with this person and wait for this change? Or you're like, no, you know, that's on them. If they're changing, fine, go ahead and change and maybe you can catch up to me when you change. If I'm available, fine. If I'm not, that's on you. That's your loss. <laughs> that's what I'm hearing here. And that is exactly what I'm hearing. Like some of you are not playing with somebody anymore with this tower. It's like you're tired of things falling apart and you're not, you feel like I'm not the cause of it. Whose reading was like this? Um, was it Leo's reading? No, I don't know. I don't think it was Leo. Maybe Taurus. I'm sorry, guys. I can't remember. But either Leo or Taurus readings had uh, some of these cards in here, I believe. Or was it Virgo? I can't. I don't know. But I feel like one of these other uh, signs had the cards in the same placement. But anyway, with the tower... 
with the four of wands reversed you're like this isn't stable i'm not gonna keep dealing with this i don't know what to do about it because i'm not causing the problems or the issues but somebody is going to try to make this right, but you're not going to trust this person because the magician is reversed, the hierophant is reversed, the four of wands is reversed, and it's with the tower. So you're like, prove yourself or stop wasting my damn time. Stop trying to manipulate the situation and trying to get me to stay. Every time you're mad at this person, they take action. Yep, because we have the world, the three of swords, and the page, of, um, I'm sorry, the knight of wands. Some of you may even be taking action on the situation and the action that you may be taking is that you're ending this or you're not talking to this person so they have no clue where they stand with you but it's because of a third party situation there's too much disappointment with the three of swords too many stormy times that you're dealing with and you're like i know that there's better i know that there's better for my life my love life or, or whatever this is in reference to. So you're like, I got to take action on this. So I feel like some of you may be taking action. And this person, maybe it's catching them off guard with this tower. Maybe you were ignoring someone and then they finally text you. And you sent them a text message back, a text message back and they didn't like what you said. And I feel like you set this fire off. <laughs> this fire that's in this tower. This tire, tower came crumbling down. But it was because of you being frustrated and pissed off is what I'm seeing here. All right. What messages do you have for Sagittarius? Let's see what you can expect from this Sagittarius. What can Sagittarius expect? The Hermit. Okay. Someone trying to hold back and act like they don't care. With the Nine of Wands, the King of Swords. Because... Okay, so this could be an air sign for some of you, a Libra, Gemini, or an Aquarius that's trying to hold back, but yet they keep thinking about you. We also have Virgo energy here as well. So somebody may be trying to act like they're not bothered, even though they are, because the Hermit is showing up. So even though they withdrew themselves i feel like you withdrew yourselves and they may be trying to out stubborn you in some sort of way but it's not going to work they're doing it because you spoke up about your feelings you're doing it because you're fed up you're tired and you're frustrated <laughs> so you're like you know you don't have a right to be holding back from me but i have every right to hold back from you and speak my opinion so what messages do you have for sagittarius I should have known that was coming. I should have just braced myself for this card sliding out of the deck and on the table. The nine of cups is reversed. You're tired of not being happy. You're like, okay, if I'm not going to be happy, then I don't want to be in this relationship. What messages do you have for Sagittarius? What can they expect? All right, so you have two cards here. You have the death card reverse and the five of cups. Somebody don't want to give up on you. They have a lot of regret. But this person's problem is they need to change. This could be a Scorpio for some of you with the death card reversed. This may be someone who actually wants to be with you. But yep, it requires a change with the judgment card here. An awakening. This person is having an awakening about you. They know what they have to do to fix this situation. But whatever it is that they have to do, they're resisting some sort of change with the death card reverse. Um, I don't know. I'm just channeling that this person may be resisting this change because they know that it comes with a lot. You know, change is never easy for anyone, first of all. Um, that's the first thing. Second thing that when you change, you have to commit to this change and, and follow through. And there's something about this situation that lacks follow through because I feel like someone always promises you that they're going to change, that they're going to do the right thing. And they may for a little bit and then they go right back to their old behavior or they, they don't do what they said they're going to do. For some reason, I feel like um, this person may have a third party situation where... 
they're free to give it all up and come towards you and then have things fall apart and not work out. So take that how it resonates. Um, it's not going to be everybody's story, but it's somebody's story out there. What messages do you have for Sagittarius? What can they expect? All right. You can expect a Leo to try to fix this situation for um, this situation with you. With the Six of Pentacles, the Sun reverse, and the Strength card reverse, this person is trying to hold back from you, but they're not going to be able to. They're going to come right towards you, promising you an equal give and take. Let's try. Let's work on this. I tried to hold back for as long as I could. But remember what I said, Sagittarius, this it's like this person is trying to out stubborn you, but they're not going to be able to do it because their reasons that they're holding back is not your like your reasons are not the same. You may feel you have every right to hold back from this person because of how they've treated you, how they hurt you and disappointed you. They're holding back because you're not saying anything to them. Or because you're standing on business and they don't like that. They're not used to it. This energy doesn't feel good to them. Somebody is used to you always being there for them, but they don't have that anymore. Let's get one more. Give me one more for Sagittarius. I feel like this person don't have your... Um, what word am I lacking here? They don't have your... It's like they don't have you in their corner anymore and it's driving them crazy. I don't think it's pissing them off or making them mad. I feel like it's driving them crazy because they're they're wondering like, okay, has Sagittarius really given up on me? Or it's like I'm hearing I, I don't have Sagittarius in my corner anymore. I never saw it coming to this. The Seven of Swords. The King of Pentacles reversed. Yep, the Five of Pentacles, the Ten of Wands. The seven of wands. Oh, wow. Okay. Um, somebody feels really bad because of how they treated you. They were being sneaky with the seven of swords and the king of pentacles reversal of earth sign virgo Taurus, capricorn possibly being sneaky kept sneaking away from you and then coming back and then doing it all over again and thought you were going to continue to put up with it and you left this person out in the cold or you started pulling away from them with the seven of wands you're guarding your emotions your your um your heart it's like you're not letting them see your hand anymore so they don't know how you feel what you're thinking what you're up to and it's bothering the hell out of them they're trying to figure out what to do about this what should I do about this dilemma that I have with Sagittarius? Because, you know, I didn't think that this was going to happen. And now they're feeling like the Ten of Wands. They're burdened by this. Even if you don't think that there are, even if they're not saying anything, trust me, they're burdened by this. All right, I need to get one more because I need to see. Give me one more. One more for Sagittarius. Yeah, the Four of Cups, the Fool, the Hangman. Delays. This person is wondering if you're really going to go in a new direction. Are you going to follow your heart? This could be an Aries or a Pisces. But they feel like you're that missed opportunity. They're like, I should have treated Sagittarius better. I didn't see things turning out like this i didn't see this coming and with this tower oh i don't even know how that just happened but anyway those cards just flew right out of my hand with this tower it came out of nowhere so i feel like you shocked this person as to how you're handling this right all right y'all this person must hear us talking about them that is it that is all <laughs> thank you sagittarius for watching my channel and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.